So a few of you might be wondering why I decided to do this. After all, hunting and mining videos are easy videos to make and people enjoy them. If that's the case, then why would I decide to make a series that could take a couple of days to do a video when I'm feeling good uh, and not even be super long videos either? Simple. There's more challenge in doing this type of video, plus my deposit goals in games are more based on investment, you know, deeds, shares, items, rings, all that good stuff. Using that money for hunting and mining just isn't a priority. But those are still things that I want to do. Well, hunting is. Maybe a little bit of mining, but mainly hunting. The main reason why though is to help other players, especially players that come from like a low economical background. Uh, you see, to me, Entropy Universe isn't just a random game that I pick up every so often. I have friends in this game and I've built a community around this game, so I figured why not strip myself down to nothing but my VSC Mark 1. Everything I own is either in storage on Calypso or inside my quad wing which is stored here on Rocktropia. Oh yeah, I decided to start out here on Rocktropia for reasons. So how exactly is this series going to work? Well, every video will have a specific goal in mind. This video, for instance, I went into it with the goal of doing a bit of hunting and a bit of mining. A simple proof of concept that even a free-to-play player can do these things without too much effort. The method for this changes planet to planet, but the base concept remains the same. Collect stuff to sell to either the TT or to another player, then buy the bare basics to get started. Again, the method will change planet to planet and new players do get given like very basic things during their first time playing. So if you're planning on being free to play or want to deposit into just deeds and shares and items, make sure you have a plan in mind before you squander anything you might get during the tutorial and like early areas. All right, let's get started. Since I was on Rocktropia, the first point of call was to look for some oil. I did this by going to both the docks at Noobs 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 and extractions in the Hunt the Thing area. This is a properly, this is a popular way to collect some passive PED while on Rocktropia and it can add up to a nice chunk of change over time. Extractions is also where we're going to get our initial hunting equipment. The trade terminal in Hunt the Thing sells some pretty cheap weapons. I always go with the pistol for a 14 pack, uh, which gives a total of 168 uses before it's broken. I never go with the rifle because it always seems a little bit buggy for some reason. I'm, I'm not entirely sure why. It does super low damage per second, which is perfect for my prey of choice. The L3 Rocktropians. These guys are not only super cheap to kill with a total health pool of five, but they do hardly any damage, which makes them a super easy swant mob as well. But that's for a later video. For now though, I just want to get out there and pew pew. In total, I got about six hunts in during my initial afternoon. This is thanks to the mobs being so small. So the actual cost of the hunts average out to like less than one PED. The actual loot pool is very meh, but this is just a simple stepping stone on my way to my preferred prey, the Vixens, for their gears. But those are for a later date though. After doing some hunting and oil grinding, I decided I should probably get some IRL work done, you know, yard work and all that jazz. So with that, I now come to another reason why I chose Rocktropia, the haters. These guys have 300 HP and do bugger all damage. So they are uh, like the perfect mob for doing some AFK sweating. And on the way there, I found some fruit. This happened a couple of times, so I was pretty happy with it. So now there is only one thing left to do to bring this whole, uh, you know, proof of concept to, uh, a, a, to a circle, right? And that's to do some mining. After a bit more grinding with the oil and making the decision to TT the loot that I found, I had enough PED to get a finder, extractor, and enough probes to do a few drops, which uh, concluded the proof of concept. 
you can 100% do some hunting and some mining pretty easily if you're, you know, willing to do like the cheapest stuff. It's not that hard. And the more you do it, the more it snowballs and, you know, good things will happen eventually. The goal of this video was met and now I had a good starting point. The only question left is what's the next goal? And for that, I'm going to leave this up to you guys. Once this video is uploaded, I'm going to give you guys, uh, you know, a few days to come up with a good goal that is difficult yet achievable or something you just want to see happen during this little experiment of mine. Now, I will apologize for how late this video has been. I've been sick for like two weeks and I just... <laughs> I couldn't, couldn't record this because I would just get out of breath too quickly because I have like this cold or flu or whatever. But I'm all good now and I'm planning on continuing stuff. Anyway guys, I'm going to leave it there for today. I want to say a big thank you to my channel members for supporting me monetarily as well as all of my viewers for supporting me over the years. It's been great and I'm re I really appreciate every single one of you. You all take care. Stay safe. And I'll see you all in the next one.